I'm Maria Bailey, and um, I'm delighted to have you with us tonight on Mom TV. If you haven't been to Mom TV, I hope that you'll stick around and um, discover some of the exciting stuff that we have here. We do um, not only live events like this online Mom Social, but we also do um, all of our videos are Mom produced or Mom targeted and it's as easy as cut and pasting your URL. So if you want to get more distribution, if you're a blogger and you want to get more distribution for video, on your videos, uh, feel free to start a channel on Mom TV, and we promote them as, much, as best we can, and we're happy to do so. We also have live shows on Mom TV, and um, tomorrow night they're very, very fun because what happens is um, it's, it's a mom who's hosting the show. They're all a half hour long, like tonight's will be um, a half hour long. And tomorrow night at 9 o'clock, you'll see Style with Jessica McFadden, and that's 9 o'clock Eastern Time. And what's great about it is, as Jessica's doing her thing about fashion, you can talk to Jess Jessica just like you're doing tonight in the chat room. On Wednesday at 3 o'clock, we have Susan Barash, whose show is called Being a Wife, and um, what, it's just really fun. If you haven't seen the live show, you got to stop in and see one. If you don't remember all the things I'm saying tonight, you can go on Mom TV, and we have a calendar of all of our live shows. On Thursday at noon is Leslie Gale, who does a fantastic job on her show, and then at 2 o'clock, Charlene of Charlene Chronicles is on. Let me tell you, Charlene, she does research for her shows. They're really engaging, very well organized, and um, and uh, anyways, you'll really like it. And and the fun thing is, is like Charlene has guests sometimes, and you can um, you can talk to the guests. You can submit your question. It's very very cool. And then at noon on Friday, we have I Mommies in the Kitchen with um, Shelby Barone and Jill Parkins, and that's very fun too. So for all of those shows, you can just go on Mom TV and on our calendar. And, um, and the best thing is too, if you don't want to switch over to MomTV.com, you can always watch via Facebook. So um, let me tell you how tonight works. Basically, I have a whole bunch of prizes, and in the next 30 minutes or less, I'm going to give them all away. Um, we are really excited to have you here, and um, basically we just ask, ask that um, we pick our win winners randomly, so all you have to do is be a part of the discussion, use the hashtag MomTV, and um, we will um, randomly select uh, winners. So, you know, a lot of the prizes that we have tonight actually are toys and the holiday season is coming upon us. It, does, it certainly doesn't feel like it should be Thanksgiving next week, but I guess it is. So um, let's start by giving away, I'm going to give away the biggest thing. And we've got two of these tonight, so if you don't win it the first time, I gave away one the other day. Okay, so I'm sorry, let me explain again um, because I probably didn't explain it very well. So we just chat. And you can either um, use the hashtag, and I'm going to let Elizabeth probably write the rules in the little chat room here. Just use the hashtag MomTV when you answer any of your questions, and you can, um, we will select a winner right here in this chat room. So, um, yes, you're right, um, Mella, you, that's the way to do it. And um, anyway. Okay, so um, I'm going to have, I think, somewhere between 18 and 30 people, I don't know, at my house for um, Thanksgiving. So I figure we can talk about Thanksgiving, too. And Tagla, you got it right. Okay, so I have this big old Defiant set. If you have a little boy in your house, this is the first thing we're going to give away tonight. But I'm going to give away two of them. So if you don't win it the first time, then you can win it the second time. And... Um, Anyways, I don't know, since you guys are starting your holiday shopping, I thought that this would be really great to kick off with because it's so big. Defiance is a real-life um, car set, and you can find it at defiance4x4s.com. But um, it's sold at Walmart and all the big 
box retailers. It's very fun. All the boys can crash them up and everything. So why don't we, since we're talking about holiday and the fact that somebody's going to give this to their child probably um, for the holiday season, let's, um, why doesn't everybody share with us what is one gift that you have bought so far this holiday season? And if you haven't bought anything, a fair answer is I haven't bought anything. But use the hashtag um, MomTV and we'll randomly um, pick someone. So somebody asked if this was a trampoline. No, this is a big set of defiance that we're going to give away tonight. Flipping out fury is what it's called. It's really big. And um, it comes with a exclusive car here, a special edition one. Um, and uh, it comes with a handle, so it's really cool. So um, anyways, okay, since no one's in the room, I'll tell you what I've bought so far. I have teenagers, and um, I got a request from two of mine that just left for college that they wanted Tempur-Pedic pillows. So that's the extent of my buying for the holidays so far, Tempur-Pedic pillows, if you can get that. Although I did get this... Delia's catalog today, which has circled in it, I think just about everything that is remotely one direction is circled in the Delia's catalog. So I may be going shopping later on with this little coupon. Okay, so um, let's draw for a winner of the um, Defiance, and we'll get rid of the Defiance. Okay, so... Um, Anyways, so now I also have, and we've got two of these tonight, so we're going to give away, oh, hold on for a second, we're going to give away one now, and then I'll give away one later on, but this is, um, hold on for a second, look at this, this is adorable, isn't it? It's the Very Hungry Caterpillar Storytime Pal by Zobies. It's a plush toy, and... Um, we're also going to put the book with it. I got the book here. Oh, I got the Very Hungry Caterpillar book right here. So we're going to give away, um, we're going to give, the first set is going to have the book with it. Well, you know what? I have another book in my office. So we'll give away the book. Oops, sorry. Um, the book, The Very Hungry Caterpillar, along with the plush toy. And um, Zobies has teamed up with the world of Eric Carl to bring you the Very Hungry Caterpillar, the limited edition plush toy, uh, folds into a pillow with a butterfly print um, blanket zipped inside. So right here, if you look at this, this is kind of cool. It's, look how cool this is. So when it comes undone, see, it folds out or it can fold in and um, there's a large, okay, I'm going to figure out where it is here, you guys, oh, here, right here, there is a large plush blanket inside, look at this, how cool is this, there's a plush blanket, I'm not, I don't want to take it apart because I don't want you guys to have to put it, but a beautiful you know, large plush blanket inside and I might as well go ahead and take it out so I can show you guys. Yeah. And whoever wins it, I'm sorry, you're going to have to look. Here we go. Oh, look at this, how pretty this is. It's got a plush blanket inside of it. How cool is this? Look at that. And it, the butterfly, it's so soft. I wish you guys could see it. Um, well, you can feel it. I know you can see it. So we have this beautiful plush blanket that comes inside of the very hungry caterpillar and I'm going to give you the book with it and are you guys familiar with the hungry caterpillar um, books I'm sure you guys are they're lovely 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 story lovely pictures and we're going to give two away so um, if you were a hungry caterpillar what would be the food that you would eat most? Okay, so that's um, the answer. I need you to just tweet using the hashtag MomTV. I mean, put it in the chat room here. And if you could eat anything, um, what would it be? 
and we're going to give one away now and I'll give away one in just a second. Um, the answer, my answer probably would be a fresh loaf of French bread. I love French bread with saltless butter, saltless European butter. That's what I would eat if I was a hungry caterpillar just like this. So um, we're going to give one away now and then we'll give one away um, again in just a few minutes. So we got to give everybody a chance. I love cheesecake. Not much of a cheesecake person. Cookie dough. Oh my gosh. A couple of weeks ago they had buy one get one free cookie dough and I'm telling you we bought the cookie dough just so that we could have it in the refrigerator and eat later on. So um, okay Jeannie's going to leave us now to go get some cheesecake apparently. Anyways so Elizabeth um, why do can't get past the raw egg thing. I know, I love the raw egg. Um, okay, so um, Elizabeth, will you randomly pick someone that's going to win this beautiful Eric Carl um, plush toy from Zombies, or Zobies, and a book to go with it. And then we're going to give another one away in just a second. Okay, so we're going to go back to, um, well, I guess it could be a boy or a girl toy. We've got from the makers of Hexbug, the Tagamoto Code the Road. Now this is very cool. If you know about Hexbugs, you know that the technology is very cool. As it passes over areas of the track, the cars do different things. And this is the Enforcer Road Set. And we're going to give two of these away. We're going to give one away now. And we're going to give one away in just a second. So. Um, the first one, however, to be eligible to win, um, you know, next week is uh, Thanksgiving. So why don't you tweet us, or with the hashtag, uh, share with everybody what is your favorite, since we're talking about food, what's your favorite food to eat at Thanksgiving? And everybody can um, give us your answer. Your name will go in the hat, and we'll have, um, we'll have Elizabeth randomly pick a um, a winner in just a second. Um, Takamoto, as I said before, is from the makers of Hexbug. If you got a little boy, it's really an awesome toy. It's hot and new this um, holiday season. It has a realistic siren. I I saw the set set up at um, Time to Play, and I have to tell you, it's very cool because when the cars go over this track. Uh, when the cars go over this track, literally they do different things and every car has kind of different um, levers and, and triggers in it. So Tagamoto, Code the Road, we're going to give away one now and we'll give away another one in just a second. So Elizabeth, do you want to go ahead and pick someone's name and we'll um, give it out. Okay, since we're talking about hex bugs, and I, I promise you we do have um, things for moms and girls things, but since we're talking about hex bugs, check this out. We have from hex bug one of their remote control spiders, and um, this thing is very cool. It's a seven-way radio control spider. Um, if you know about hex bugs, they develop some of the coolest, coolest toys we actually have two of these to give away. So we're going to give away a spider right now, and I think we have a different animal in the office. Um, there are several that come um, with it. I think we have two spiders, so we'll give away two spiders tonight. Um, so um, with this, since we're talking about spiders, is there a particular animal that you absolutely are afraid of? Because I know people who are afraid of spiders. Um, so share with us what kind of animal that you're afraid of. And I'll tell you what mine is. And most of you guys um, live up north, so you probably don't experience this, but lizards. I absolutely hate lizards. And I will tell you why I hate lizards. The reason I hate lizards is because this little boy in the first grade, his name was Monty Levy, and God forbid if one of you guys married him, but... Um, and I don't know it, but Monty, Monty bit the head of a lizard when we were in the first grade, and the lizard got 
stuck on his tongue, like bit down on his tongue. And that thing was like flapping around. And I'm telling you from this day forward, I cannot deal with lizards. And I live in Florida and there's a ton of lizards here. Anyhow, um, <laughs> let's give away um, the spider. We're gonna give away one now, and then we're gonna give away one in just a second. So Elizabeth, you wanna go ahead and draw the name, okay? And y'all don't forget that if Elizabeth tells you you won something, to make sure that you please email her so that we can get these prizes out to you as soon as possible because my office is very cluttered with stuff and um, I wanna get rid of them. Okay, so this is gonna be really, really fun. This is a special treat for mom, okay? And I'm sorry we're talking about food tonight, but from the folks at Sartino, Sartori cheeses, we're giving away um, an assortment of cheeses. And as you can tell, it was so delicious that the, the group in my office cut into this <laughs> sample of cheese. But they literally devoured the, um, the cheese that they sent to us. So we're gonna give away to some lucky person, Sart, um, Sartori cheese. and. It comes, I think, on a big platter. It'll be perfect if you can get it for the holidays, which I'm sure we'll give. We'll, we can do that. And um, and the folks at Sartori Cheese have been so generous to send us this. So why don't, since we're talking about food, everybody, let's share with each other um, what your favorite kind of cheese is, and um, and we'll pick a winner for the Sartori Cheese. Okay. Um, so, how y'all liking these um, online socials so far? They go really fast, they're fun, I get to talk about the products, we don't just tweet about them. So, um, so y'all, you like that southern y'all there? So y'all tell us um, what kind of cheese you like and um, somebody will win the assortment of Sartori cheese. And um, I gotta tell you, this is actually is a limited edition Cognac Bellavitino. The Sartori family is dedicated to making the finest cheeses in the world. They think they're great dairy farming families in Wisconsin that share premium milk in conversation with their expert cheese makers, and they've been doing so since 1938. Okay. Um, so. Anyways, um, so Elizabeth, Elizabeth, pull a name so that somebody can get some cheese sent to them, okay? Okay, so um, another, I know you guys are thinking we're doing all food tonight, but we have a couple of these that we're gonna give away. We're gonna send somebody a case of good greens these are good green chocolate um, chocolate coconut bars. And again, these chocolate coconut bars from Good Greens, my office loves them. Why? Because they're protein bars with omega-3, with 12 grams of protein, three different probiotics, 40 antioxidant. They're low glycemic count. So um, I noticed today when I was cleaning up our kitchen area that an entire box was gone. I don't know who in my office ate them all, but they were gone. And um, this is what I love about them. They're less than 200 calories. If you go to, into like a 7-Eleven or something and you buy the average protein bar, you'll notice that they have like 250 to 300 calories. These actually um, have less than 200 calories. So. Um, let everybody tell me, because I'm a huge believer that protein is very important to your diet. What's your favorite protein? And um, tell me what your favorite protein is, and then um, we'll draw a name of someone who's going to get this case of good, good greens protein bars. This happens to be the coconut chocolate. What else am I going to go? Oh, we're going to give away two of these. So. Um, one right now and one in just a second. 
Um, so my favorite protein is um, I'm a huge, huge fan of egg whites. I eat egg whites every single morning, and um, I love egg whites. So um, I don't eat red meat, so that's a little hard to get my protein from red meat. In fact, I ate the last piece of red meat I've ever eaten in 1982. Yes, most of you guys weren't even born in 1982. I was born in... Okay, we're here. Okay. Okay, you guys there? Okay, here we go. Well, I'm back. Okay, so let's pick a, a winner. And um, sorry about that. My home internet access went down for a minute. Okay, so let's pick a winner and give these out. Okay. And... Our next prize, I love this. Okay, so I went to, you guys, I gotta take it out of the package so that you can fully appreciate it. It was invented by a mom, which you know that I love products that were invented by a mom. And um, I was at the ABC Kid Product Show and I stumbled upon a press release, first of all, that described this particular product and then I saw it firsthand and I was like oh my gosh where was this when I had children that loved Legos and little different things it is called the toy dozer have you guys ever seen this okay how many of you guys struggle and you do this all the time and try to pick up the Legos or whatever your children have well, let me show you right here okay this is the toy dozer. So let's say I'll use some grapes, okay? I happen to have grapes on my counter. Let's say these grapes right here are all Legos and they're all over your floor. All you do with the toy dozer is it has this little piece here that you take off. It's stuck on with Velcro. By the way, it is produced in the United States. You use this one side and you literally go like this, creating kind of a bulldozer. And here's all your Legos, right here, right here. See where the grapes are? Imagine those are Legos. So you got Legos all over your tape, all over the floor. You scoop, they go in, it's called the toy dozer. It is brilliant. A mom invented it and she literally has gone out of her way. It's manufactured, I believe, in Pennsylvania, but it makes no more is cleaning up just a hassle. It makes toy clean up fast. Um, she really was determined to, you, to make it in the United States. She did. It's called the Toy Dozer. I'm telling you, like, you guys, this should have been invented a long time ago. So, some lucky mom is going to get one of these toy dozers tonight. And um, what I want to find out is, what is the one toy you just dread cleaning up with? Or what would you use your toy dozer to clean up with? Um, let us know, and we will see if we can um, pull your name and you become a winner. So it's a two-piece cleanup set invented by a mom, and um, it's gotten a lot of accolades. It's made in the United States. You can get one at toydozer.com, and um, it's just really fantastic. The mom and dad who manufacture it um, are wonderful people, and um, 
want to know what kind of toy, what kind of toys would you pick up with your toy dozer? And we'll draw a name very quickly in just a second. So get your um, name in there, and we'll um, pull a name for someone to win a toy dozer. So Elizabeth, why don't you um, pull a name, and we'll get the toy dozer away? Because Lord knows. I agree. When you step on a Lego, that just really, 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 really hurts. Okay, so we're getting close to the end where I need to start giving away second this second versions of things. So, um, so let's give away another pack of the um, Good Greens protein bars. Again, high in protein. Um, why don't you let me know? Um, to win the protein bars, when, when, what time of day is it that you most are likely to grab a protein bar? Share with us um, when you're most likely to grab a protein bar and use the hashtag MomTV and your name will go in the hat to win one. Remember the Good Greens protein bars have less than 200 calories, which is really great. 12 grams of protein, three different probiotics. They are really, really good for you, and best of all, they taste good, which is something that we like. So um, we're going to give another case of them away. How many case, How many bars are in here? Um, hold on for a second. Let me see. How many bars are you getting? 12 bars in here. So you think about that, like 12 times at least like $2 each. So this is like a $25 value. Really, really good stuff. So we're going to draw a name for that. And um, let's give that away, Elizabeth, so that we can move on to our next prize. you got to be fast with your answers here. OK, so our next prize is a $20 gift card to Puma. Puma gift card, 20 bucks. You know what? Let's go for the gusto here, you guys. I'm going to give away $40 worth of Puma gift cards. That way you can buy more and you won't have to um, use your own money. So um, $40 worth of Puma gift cards. If you can tell me one show that I mentioned earlier, and if you have to go to Mom TV to look at the schedule, that's good. But name one of the shows that happens on Mom TV this week. So. Um, I told you that we have great live shows going on this week. Um, if you could just name one of the shows, then um, your name will go in the hat for um, one of these Puma gift cards. And I really encourage you to come back to Mom TV. You can actually watch Mom TV right through Facebook. So um, you don't even have to get off of Facebook. You can go to our Facebook page and watch. Um, click on the right rail where it says watch a live show and the show will come up right there on Facebook. Um, and I really encourage you Tuesday, um, tomorrow night at 9 o'clock will be Jessica McFadden. She does a great show. You're going to love it. It's so much fun because the host like gets going and you know you guys get to chat with each other. So um, come back and watch it tomorrow night at 9 o'clock. Um, Okay, everybody have a chance to answer? Elizabeth, I'm going to let you draw for the $40 worth of Puma gift cards, and some lucky mom will, will get those. Okay, you know what? I lied to you earlier, you guys. I told you that we had another one of these really cute plush toys, which we do. We're going to give away another one next week. But I have another Eric Carl toy to give away. Hold on for a second. Let me put this away so that you don't. Don't mess it up. Look at this. Okay, so now what I got is I got the book again, The Very Hungry Caterpillar by Eric Carle, which my children love. But we're also going to give away this toy. Hold on for a second. It is The Very Hungry Caterpillar Apple Playset. It's, um, it includes a Velcro top closure clear front panel right here, and an additional side opening for in and out play. The Very Hungry Caterpillar can peek out of the side or climb in to eat five different fruits. The five fruit pieces contain 
crinkle, squeak, and jingle sounds for additional entertainment, and your child's imagination is sure to run wild with this Eric Carl Apple playset. So you're going to get a book, and you're, you're going to get a book, and you're going to get the playset um, for this. It's recommended for zero to twenty-four months. It retails for twenty dollars at Babies R Us, and you're going to get the Barnes and Noble copy of the book, which is another fifteen dollars. So this is a pretty good set, and um, and so with that, um, since we're talking about apples, what is your favorite way to eat an apple? Um, share with that us on Mom with using the hashtag Mom TV, and you'll get the very hungry caterpillar and the wonderful playset. This will be make a wonderful. Wouldn't this make a great baby shower gift as well? I have to go to a baby shower soon, and something like this is just so different than what everybody else would probably bring. And, you know, this book, your children, you'll never get rid of this. I mean, uh, don't you just remember that, how it starts? Hold on, I gotta read a little bit for you. Oh my gosh, and this one is like signed with a note from Eric in it. Hold on for a second. Let's see here. In the light of a moon, a little egg lay on the leaf. Oh, it's so beautiful. In one Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and pop out of the egg came a tiny, very hungry caterpillar. And the story goes on from there. So Elizabeth, let's let someone win this. And we're going to thank the folks over at Eric Carl for letting us give this place that away. It's again available at Babies R Us if you want to get um, a copy if you don't win one tonight. Okay, so who wants more cheese? Let's give away some more um, Sartori cheese. Uh, this one happens to be a limited edition, but wouldn't you just love to have a little cheese and wine going on this holiday season next to the fireplace? And what better cheese to serve than Sartori cheese? They've been making cheese since 1939. Do I sound like a commercial? But it is really good. Okay, so they sent one of these to my office, and it was gone. Like, I never saw, this is what was left of it um, tonight. I had to grab this out of the refrigerator. Anyways, um, so where and how is your favorite place to eat cheese? Like, how do you enjoy eating cheese? Um, I like it in my egg, in my egg whites. But how do you enjoy eating cheese? And some lucky mom will win an assortment of Sartori cheese, and they'll be shipping that directly to you. So um, hopefully you'll get it before the holidays, which I'm sure you will, and um, you'll enjoy it as much as everyone in our office enjoyed Sartori cheese. Um, there's nothing like a really, really, really good cheese. So, um, so we'll put that over there. We'll give you a minute to um, answer. So um, we have another one of these online socials planned for early next week. Uh, you want to sign up for our newsletter so that we can keep you posted on when we have these um, going on. They're happening all the time, so you don't want to miss out on them. And um, Elizabeth, why don't you go ahead and pick a winner for the Sart Sartori cheese? And um, we'll get that cheese out to the to the winner, okay? I'm um, trying to put the Eric Carl away so I don't ruin it. You guys, don't forget, if you win a gift tonight, to please email Elizabeth so we can get it out to you. Okay. We're down to, um, hold on for a second. Okay. Let's give away another hex bug spider to a lucky winner tonight. Um, tell us one of the different things that is offered on Mom TV for a chance to win another one of these great Hexbug uh, remote control. Um, tell us some of the different things that are offered on Mom TV, and um, we will put your name in the hat for the 360 steering remote control Hexbug. You know, I got to tell you, the Hexbug and um, the Hexbug products are just phenomenal. 
I met some of the engineers in Hong Kong and they are just like, they really care about innovative new toys. And um, remember the first little hex bugs, those little tiny ones, they look like roaches running around. They were just the funniest. And my favorite actually are the Easter hex bugs. But um, we're gonna have a lucky mom win this. So Elizabeth, there are um, the nanos. That's right, some mom just told me that. Um, it's approaching the hour and I got two more gifts to give away, so please draw a name so we can give away another hex bug. Okay, talking about hex bugs, let's give an, away another Tagamoto um, toy um, vehicle kit, tagamoto.com from the makers of hex bugs. Um, you know, there's been a lot of talk and this is, um, Tagamoto is all about race cars. So. If you could buy your dream race car or your dream car, what would it be? Why don't you share it with the rest of the moms? And um, we will select a mom who can, um, a mom who will win this Tagamoto that we have a ton of them that we're going to be giving away next week as well. So, um, so let's give this one away soon. Okay, so my dream car is a Porsche box. And um, I'm determined one day I'm going to get it. Ooh, a Range Rover. That's a cool. Um, that's a cool car too. Austin Martin. I saw a Bentley the other day. That was really cool. Anyways, um, let's. Um, I'm just got, oh my gosh, the answers are so fast. I, don't, I can't even see them. Um, all of the above. <laughs> that's funny. Okay, so. Um, Elizabeth, will you draw the name of some lucky person who will win the Tagamoto? Okay, so we started the hour out with these big sets of defiance. So um, let's end the, uh, the social with giving out another pack of defiance. This is a flipped out Fury defiance. They're available at Walmart and all the big box retailers. Very, very, very cool and affordable holiday gift this um, holiday season. So since we're talking about the holidays coming up, what is one thing that is on your wish list? Because maybe we can get one to give away here on Mom TV. But um, what is something that you're looking forward to getting for yourself this holiday season? And I, while we're doing this, have you guys seen the your Santa, YourSantaStory.com website where you can get a customized um, video from Santa Claus to your family. So, so, so cool. We're going to be giving away some of those as well. So you can go to YourSantaStory.com and um, see it. But what are you, um, what are you looking to get this um, holiday season? I see a lot of iPads coming through. Um, a lot of tablets. So moms want technology, I see. Um, whole new coffee maker. You know, I've never had a cup of coffee in my adult life. Um, another car for our family. Maybe you can get that, that racing car. Um, anyways, okay, Elizabeth, why don't you go ahead and draw a name from, um, from our winners, and I just want to tell you guys that we're going to do another one of these online socials. We have so many prizes and toys in our office, I can't even begin to tell you how much we have to give away in the coming week. And you'll want to sign up for our newsletter on Mom TV because we also have this really great thing that we're doing called um, Share a Mom TV video every day. And we're going to be giving away prizes every single day. And it's as easy as just doing a really quick video and answering the theme or according to the theme of the day. So, um, so you want to definitely sign up for our newsletter. That way you know when these online socials are happening and also um, what's going on on Mom TV. Join us tomorrow night at 9 o'clock for Jessica McFadden's show and then 3 o'clock on Wednesday for Susan Barash being a wife, and um, noon on Thursday, Leslie Gale, and then Friday with the I Mommies in the Kitchen. Um, I want to congratulate all the winners. Elizabeth, make sure that you draw the last winner. 
And um, thanks everyone for coming. Make sure you check out Mom TV and all the great videos that are there. And um, we'll do it again next week, that's for sure. Thanks everybody.